This part of the testbed investigates the use of Esri's Open File Geodatabase API and the use of File Geodatabase in the transfer of bulk geodata. The specific OWS8 testbed requirement is to evaluate and demonstrate a method for distributing bulk geodata efficiently using a method that will work over COMPS infrastructure, both high bandwidth or possibly very constrained bandwidth. So data compression is important and in some cases might be sneaker net using hard media such as CD, DVD, or memory sticks. To demonstrate the interoperability of the file geodatabase, the test is between two separate systems, Esri and OpenGeo. Data integrity checks were performed following a round trip similar to what is shown in the following scenario. In this scenario, the National Guard headquarters in Sacramento, California, has a large data set covering Central California that will provide a common base map for all emergency centers in the affected areas. This base map is provided to an operations center at the Monterey Airport. The operator, knowing the local situation, recognizes a need for providing some updates to the base map. The field center updates the base map and sends it back to the National Guard headquarters, who then checks out the integrity of the data and the changes before sending it back out to the rest of the field operations centers. Lance, at the California National Guard headquarters in Sacramento, creates a file geodatabase using Esri's ArcGIS. He ships it to the field center at Monterey Airport. Using the file geodatabase API, Paul at the field center uploads the file geodatabase bulk data into a Postgres spatial database server. Then using OpenGeo Suite, Paul updates the data using input from local observers and creates a new file geodatabase. The new file geodatabase is then transferred back to headquarters in Sacramento. Lance opens a new file geodatabase and checks the existing stable data to ensure feature coordinates and attributes weren't altered during transmission, during the creation of Postgres GI database, or when reloading to a new file geodatabase. He also examines and approves the new changes. The data is then ready to be shipped to any other field centers or to first responders who require the latest base map data. Hello, this is Lance at National Guard Headquarters in Sacramento. We have our base data, it's in a file geodatabase, and we're going to zip it up and ship it off to the field center at Monterey Airport. So first, we will take our file geodatabase and zip it with 7-zip, Then we will copy that, and then uh, paste that into an email, and we will ship that out to Paul.